I got a question for all you pilots out there. I know we've learned how to do a mag check during run-up, but what do you do if you really, really have a problem? What does it sound like? What does the airplane do? And most importantly, what are you gonna do? We were departing from St. Petersburg, we were all set, ready to go, and then this happened. Here we go, engine run up, heading a brake set, mixture is gonna be lean, bring it up to 1700, we've got a mag check. Hit it too much, son of a bitch. Wait, let me get back up. Damn it. All right, let's start it over. Ready? Yeah. Well, that is the right mag. She shuts off at the right mag. Is your mixture supposed to be full rich? Yeah, no. but um, it's okay. I always leave it a little, oh. little lean, but. Okay, 1700. Right mags out. Huh. Where's your checklist? Right here. No, it's I go to the right mag and she's out. Extra lane, okay, power to 1700. Yep, 1700, watch. All right, so 1700, we'll go mixture full rich. Left mag's fine, got a nice drop. Yeah. Oh wait, I got no drop in 17, I got no drop in, in the left mag, look. Let me get her back to 1700. I got no drop. I go back to both. I go back to the right. I That's not back. good. Yeah. Huh. All right. We did ground uh, 221 for Yankee. We're going to have to go back. 3 Yankee, roger. Um, back to the FBO. Copy. 221 for Yankee. How does an airplane have no problems one day, and then mags out the next? I don't know, but do they have someone here that can look at it? We'll find out. Yeah. Think a mechanic will walk out here? Yeah, probably. Okay, 1700. Mixtures go full rich. Left mag, no drop. Yeah, there's no drop. No. no. Huh. Yeah, shut this puppy down. Yeah. Well, let's think of all the good things. So yes, as luck would have it, there was a mechanic available at St. Pete Air, which was right on the other side of the airfield. And we went into the FBO, made a quick phone call, and sure enough, the guy was right there, took a look at it, diagnosed the problem, and told us when the airplane would be up and running again, which of course, it was on a Friday, so we did have to wait to Monday. But the conversation that I had with the mechanic was really helpful, and I really wanted to go back to basics when I spoke with him. Um, it could be it could be points, it could be capacitors, it could be rotor gear, it could be a coil. So I just had an annual done in August, everything's been fine. Sure. And then, um, so if a mag fails in flight, will you know it? Oh yeah, you'll have an RPM drop, mm. a slight drop, just like a mag check, you'll have a, a drop. Mm. Or you'll have it running rough or doing some, some weird stuff, so. It was running just slightly rough. I was playing with the mixture mm -hmm. when we were coming back and and I um, and then I pulled the mixture out and then we had a little bit of a cough and I put it in. And then it just wasn't, it wasn't smooth. Usually yeah, it comes. Yeah, the mag was going, yeah. So, so that was it. Okay, so I'm trying to think, so when would that have, 
And it's just a time thing, right? It just, it just goes. I mean, it can, I've seen them go, I've had new mags go mad within yeah. 50 hours. And I've had mags go to 700 hours. Wow. No problem. So then, what, basic question, I know what mags do, but what do they do? Well, <laughs> they give you a spark is what right. they do. So they, they give you that high tension uh, energy to the, to the mag, or to the, to the spark plugs to introduce a spark toward the combustion. And back. what and what drives the? It, it is a gear driven. Oh, okay. It's gear driven off the back of the. Uh, back so it's just like an old accessory. rotor, like an old. old it's engine. like a, yeah, it has a distributor in there. Okay. It's, uh, has that inside there as well. It has a coil and a set of breaker points. And, you know, oh, very so good. Old school stuff. Yeah, very, so that's very why old. it goes bad. It, 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 a lot of mechanical parts. Okay. So, yeah. And then also. Just, I just had a GTN 355 put in there, so mm -hmm. all the logbooks and everything are in the front seat. Cool. Yep. So we're going to get the Mac coming here Monday. We'll climb it on the engine, make your logbook sticker, and off you go. Thank you, sir. What time? Are you going to pick it up Monday, you think? Yep, definitely. Okay, I'm ahead. here. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, so the Mac, yeah. I mean, UPS comes around 1130. Hopefully they do. It depends. Yeah. Usually 1130. So we'll have it on by 2 o'clock. Cool, and that'll come by, I'll give you a call, whatever, and I'll come take it for a test flight and then sure. go somewhere. Sure, yeah, it should be good. Yeah. Have a great so, weekend. All right, you too, and very Thanks nice meeting you. You too.